In today's video, I'll be showing you how to update DirectX 9, 10 and 11 and also clear your DirectX shader cache within Windows 11. So the first thing you need to do to manually update DirectX in Windows 11 is click on the link that's in the description below. Once you've clicked on that link, you will then end up on a page that looks like this. You now need to go ahead and press download. So you might be wondering why I didn't say about updating DirectX 12 and that's because you cannot manually update this that is done through the Windows updates. So just ensure you always keep Windows 11 up to date and then that will ensure that you have the latest DirectX 12 installed. So once you've finished downloading that file you now need to go ahead and run the DirectX runtime web installer you will then end up with a window that looks like this. You now need to agree to the terms. If you do agree, click I accept and you then need to go next. You can then choose if you want to install the Bing bar. I don't want to install this on my computer, so I'm going to untick that. And you can now go ahead and press next and it will now check to see if there are any new updates available for DirectX on your computer. If it does detect any new files that can be installed, it will then begin to install them. But as you can see, I do currently have the latest version of DirectX installed, so I don't need to do anything. So that is how you update DirectX 9, 10 and 11 within Windows 11. So to clear the DirectX shader cache, all you need to do is open up the start menu and you now need to type in disk and you then need to select disk cleanup and you now need to select your C drive. You now need to find the option that says DirectX Shader Cache and you now need to tick the checkbox next to it. Also go through and just untick anything else that you do not want to remove. Once you're happy with your selection, go ahead and press OK and you can now press Delete Files and that is how you remove the DirectX Shader Cache also within Windows 11. So I hope this little video helped you out and you enjoyed it. It's important to ensure that you do have the latest DirectX installed as it will help improve the smoothness and performance within games and apps. So if you did like this video, then click the like button below. And if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then click the subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.